vehicle. Once again, we have a new obstacle that Ryan has built for us. Now, this one is a bit steep. Can't see from this angle, but let's see if I can come over here and give you a better shot of how steep. It's almost vertical. I really don't know if any of the where to wheel guests out here are gonna be able to climb that. We do have a side-by-side -side who may give it an attempt and uh, a two-door um, Jeep Wrangler, but he doesn't have lockers, so it might be too much of a challenge. We will find somebody who can tackle that, though. I guarantee it. Like Ryan might give this a try. Nice correction. <laughs> Got a little light on that last run. How'd that look? Oh, uh, yeah, it looked oh, awesome. Scary. Good job. I got a perfect shot of it. That was a nice correction. Do it again. <laughs> You're catching a little bit of air on these whoops. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, like. The front end's so heavy, it just. Yeah. Yep, yeah, yeah, and the rear is definitely what's lifting when you're going through the whoops. Yeah. So it looks sweet though. Sounds good too. Oh, I'll do that right. Yeah, right on. Hey everybody, this is David here with Where to Wheel. Josh brought his uh, is it a razor or a can am? It's a can am, never. Okay. Can you uh, what year is it? It's a 23. Just got it this uh, oh, this summer. Wow. Well, okay. Let's talk tires. What size tires? Uh, it comes stock with 32s. Okay. Of course, I got 35s coming. So. Oh, nice. Right. All right. All right. Uh, axles. Are they locked front and rear? So yeah, it's it's four wheel. It, um, so the back is always locked, which is kind of tough for the streets. But okay. yeah, you can lock the front and go to full forward. Nice. All right. And uh, speaking of streets, it looks like it's street legal. Can you confirm that? Yeah, it's street legal for sure in North Carolina. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. 
while we're back here, we're looking at the engine. You said it's about 900 cc. Yeah, 900 cc, uh, single turbo, 200 horsepower. The whole machine weighs uh, just shy of 2,000 pounds. Really? It's got 13 to change inches of travel on the back, 13 up forward. Uh, this one came with the, the smart shocks, which is pretty cool. Um, to kind of control your, your ride comfort, so it's got a comfort. Are they electronically controlled? Yes. So okay. each of them has a little yeah, cylinder. Yeah. Wire going yep. Okay. Uh, sway bar, does that disconnect? Uh, no, I don't disconnect them. I think you can up front, but I, I don't. I just left them so far. Okay, okay. It's um, got plenty of articulation in the moment. Let's come in and talk about the interior here. Chris, you want to get some interior shots? Uh, oh, full three-point harnesses? Yeah. Did that come with it or did you have to add those? I think this year was the first year they came with it stock. So they're actually really nice, super comfortable. They uh, they don't have the, the worst inertia locks ever, so okay. pretty nice. Yeah, they look nice. Are they suspension seats or anything? Or they no, the seats are super comfortable. They're uh, like a tight like a neck. Uh, they don't soak water that bad at all. Uh, transmission is that CBT? It's all CBT, so it's just a big belt CJ inside. On it. Oh, yeah. uh, they've actually made the belt <laughs> pretty bomb proof. They're um, Frankenstein. I haven't had any issues with it. I've been watching the temps. This year, I think it was the first year it comes with a belt gauge as well. Oh, really? So it's nice tells you where your belt temps at so you don't blow oh, that cool. out. Yeah. All right, all right. Is there anything worth pointing out up front? I see we got a front radiator and the engine's in the rear, so that's interesting. Yeah, the intercooler's back uh, just by the uh, the air intake. It's got the radiator in front. Um, other than that, yeah, no, it's just mainly suspension up here, the, uh, the, the Fox Smart Shock. So I think they're two and a half in front and then they're full of threes in the back. Okay. It blows my mind how small that front differential is to turn 30, you're going to be turning 35 inch tires with a differential that we'll see how long it holds up. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. But I, like I, you yeah. said, it's less than 2,000 pounds, so it might hold up. Yeah, you know, I, I've, I've seen people run into issues. Um, of course, I ended up opting to get a, a warranty. Nice, that's smart, I do. smart, smart, stuff smart. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't come with a windshield. Uh, oh, really? The windshield and the light bars, that's all after. The bottom doors are after. So yeah, we got it, and then we just decided to invest in all the, the comfortable things. So okay. this is, uh, yeah, it still, I think it has 12 hours on it. So I got a, a lot of right. breaking into this. Okay, awesome. Well, thanks for talking about yeah, it. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, that thing's moving. with these side-by-sides -side, you can just spray it inside and out since we hadn't had many side-by-sides out two to be exact only um, hadn't got a chance to see what they're all capable of but that's pretty sweet you can just hose it down and not worry about your electronics getting wet and exposed pretty sweet Visit w2wparks.com to grab your tickets.